Hey everyone, welcome to this Windows channel and um, a quick tip because a lot of people actually don't know that their keyboards on their laptops does much more than just type letters and numbers. Uh, one of the things that a lot of people don't know is that there's often on pretty much every laptop a little key that's called FN which is right here. This is for functions. It's a function key. This, in combination with other keys, can do all sorts of little things. And an example that I'll show is at the top. In the top row here, you see that I have some little designs. For example, here is uh, what looks like a little sun. So this is basically for uh, an example the uh, brightness of my screen. So for example, if I go on the screen here, and if I use in combination the FN function key, and one of those, you'll see that I can actually brighten or lower the brightness of my screen. And there's actually a little icon here that you can see that actually tells me I'm doing that. And you know what? A lot of people don't know that their keyboards do a lot of things. So check it out. The function keys and your keyboard have a lot of little things that they do especially the function keys. A lot of the function keys have most of the functions of what you can do. For example here that little antenna. One of the major culprits, one of the major problems of a lot of people is that they lose Wi-Fi connection. They don't understand how they did it and it could be they just hit the wrong key without knowing it. So by using function key and that little antenna type key here on my F12 key, that gives me air the uh, airplane mode which removes or actually uh, shuts off or on the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth of my laptop. So you know there's a lot of things that can be done. There's volume controls, uh, mute controls, there's going forward, backward, playing something when you're watching a movie, a song. Uh, here, for example, I have keys for uh, using external displays and so on. So, you know, it's very important to check the keyboard and the function keys. Um, the FN key is on all laptops. It does different functions. Now, this you've seen on my computer, but on or your computer, it's different. It can be in different places. Um, it can do something else. There are keys that don't do anything with the function key. But on some computers, some of those do something. So uh, it's very important to know that. I've noticed that in most of my clients that I go to to fix their computers, they have no idea that they could do that with their computer and their keyboard. So it's very important to know function key is there for a reason. And um, if you're not sure what it does or what all of that can do, one of the great things you can do is just take your model number in your uh, computers. For example, this is a Toshiba. So you would, you know, I would generally go to uh, Toshiba.com and there I'd go and try to find the instruction manual for my own little laptop. Every company has a instruction, a full instruction manual of their computers online. It's really a shame that they don't actually include it anymore on their, um, you know, in the box with the computers, but that's a way to save money. So they have a PDF version, but on the website. So you'll have to search for it on their website and check it out. They do explain on that manual um, that, you know, what keys do what function. Also, on some computers, you don't have to use a function key. For example, on my Toshiba, this was automatic. I didn't have to use it, but I did not want to use it, so I actually shut off the automatic process, and I prefer using the function key with the key that I want to do that function. So check it out, and uh, remember, just go to your manufacturer's website if you want to know and learn more, and get your instruction manual in PDF form. If you enjoyed the videos, why not subscribe to our channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online. We have lots of videos. We have lots of videos coming. Lots of videos with new Windows 10 also will be coming up. 
So why not uh, join us? And um, if you have any comments, questions, maybe something you'd like us to talk about, let us know. I'll try to post a video online. So thank you for watching.